Vito, Viano modifications for the year. 06 and 07, there have been several modifications phased in. This vehicle is a 07 model. The vehicle is pleasant to drive with an interior styling that's sophisticated. Let's examine the modifications and new features phased in, including those introduced at the start of the year. The new instrument cluster from the Sprinter is a notable feature. Additionally, the most networking has been adopted from the Sprinter, which brings improved audio quality. The Most Bus is an optical data bus system, and its fiber optic cables transmit data rapidly to the navigation and communication systems. The central gateway forwards global information, such as the model series and national version, over CANE to the control units. In driving mode, information for control units is transferred from one CAN to another. In diagnostic mode, diagnosis query messages must be routed from the star diagnosis unit to the control units and back. Another system introduced alongside the central gateway and the most bus is the networked tire pressure monitor. In vehicles equipped with it, the system is displayed in the instrument cluster. Following changes to the instrument cluster, let's inspect the electric sliding door. It's operated via buttons in the upper control panel or the central button on the B pillar. Additionally, the engine has seen revisions. The four-cylinder engine now incorporates Piezo technology, a system already known from the Sprinter. The basic shape of the Vito, Viano engine remains unchanged, only the Piezo technology has been added. For clarity, examining the engine outside the vehicle reveals that the Vito Viano engine isn't a new development, meaning the short block engine remains identical. This contrasts with the Sprinter, where Piezo technology was initially introduced with engine 646. The installation space in the vehicle remains unchanged with only Piezo technology updates. Changes in detail are as follows. Magnetic injectors are replaced by Piezo injectors, evident in their differing designs. Components on the engine include injectors with return lines, the fuel filter, and the feed line. Their integration follows the fuel flow. These modifications were seamlessly integrated into the pre-existing engine. Along with Piezo technology, the turbocharger underwent modifications. Previously, both the wastegate turbocharger, 65 kilowatts, and the VTG turbocharger were used. Now, the VTG turbocharger with variable turbine geometry and vacuum advance remains. The wastegate turbocharger with its wastegate valve has been phased out. The VTG turbocharger's vacuum actuation has been modified to be electrically operated via an actuator motor, providing more accurate actuation.
The guide vanes move with greater precision, benefiting power variants and exhaust characteristics. Note, excessive force on the VTG turbocharger linkage can damage the worm gear in the actuator motor, which then requires the entire turbocharger's replacement. Returning to the four-cylinder engine, changes primarily encompass the piezo technology and the turbocharger. Apart from the four-cylinder engine, there's also a six-cylinder variant. Special features of the new engines include the advantages of the new piezo technology, such as a high-rated output with harmonic power and torque development. These engines meet demanding power requirements while improving fuel economy and ensuring ride comfort. The V6 engine's output in the Vito Viano is 150 kilowatts, compared to the Sprinter's 135 kilowatts. The diesel engine in the Viano offers 85 and 110 kilowatts, whereas the Vito provides 70, 85 or 110 kilowatts. Both the four- and six-cylinder Viano models come with a standard diesel particulate filter, or it'll be a mandatory addition. A retrofit solution is in development and will be available soon. The ESP has been updated. Like in the Sprinter, the ESP 8.1 system is now in place, an improvement over ESP 5.7. This new version actively incorporates the vehicle's load state into the brake intervention calculation, adjusting brakes according to the load or payload, and computing deceleration accordingly. In summary, those were the highlights of the 06 and 07 Vito Viano model.